I'm often asked what inspired me to write I Am Grateful For Life and the truth is it's my little niece. I really wanted to help her to understand exactly how lucky she is, what she could be grateful for. I wanted her to grow up understanding just how incredibly fortunate she is to have her eyesight, her ears, her nose, her mouth, little arms and legs that work. The last charity event I hosted was back in July and for every one of our guests that came along on the evening, we actually gave them a copy of the I Am Grateful For Life gift book. I have received absolutely fantastic feedback from the um, people that have looked through the gift book and just found it to be so inspirational. And I told Jo about the book. Well, Jo started to well up with tears and then she was telling me, she's going, you won't believe this, she said, my girlfriend has just been diagnosed with leukaemia. She said that would just be the perfect gift. I, I now don't even have to hesitate. I really, I leave them unwrapped because I like to write something inside, but I really feel like I can just have a dozen of these wrapped and sit, sat in my cupboard, just to give out as a gift for any occasion. I've had such a great experience with this book. The concept of gratitude is something that I was introduced to by Kim Serafini and I'm Grateful. And it's really changed my outlook on life. You know, as human beings, we tend to focus on what's going wrong and all the negatives of what's happening in our lives. But just reading a few pages of this book really changes your outlook. The really interesting thing is that once you are grateful for the really, really simple things in your life, stuff starts to happen. You start to accumulate things, you start to attract things into your life, and it all stems from being grateful. So, you know, I believe that Kim Serafini's book, I Am Grateful, is an amazing tool. To be able to give that to somebody and to start their journey of gratitude is so powerful. And uh, I'm just so grateful that I've read that book and opened my eyes even further to it. So I started thinking about my mother and what a great gift it would be for her just to let her know that I'm grateful to her for being my mother and also for um, giving me so much in my life that, that I'm grateful to her for. So it's a wonderful gift for her too. I think when someone is going through some sort of adversity or challenge then I think the words are just right and they're just enough and they're put in there in such a way that it will truly make a difference in their life. I think it's a really good thing to give to people when they're feeling down in their lives or they're going through something whether it be an emotional struggle, um, a financial struggle or something to do with their health. It's a physical reminder for them of how beautiful life really is and how much in life we've got to be grateful for. Maria has written a little testimonial for um, Kim. For Maria, I think to express how much this book meant to her. She had three um, brain hemorrhages. She was affected as um, a severe stroke victim. She was in a coma for three weeks and basically lay in hospital for months on end, unable to move, speak or do anything. When I first read I'm Grateful for Life, I felt so alive because I was so happy to be alive. Every day is a special day for me. Now I see the beautiful plants and the beautiful birds. Now I see my children and my husband in a different way. I keep reminding myself how lucky I am to be alive and how grateful I am to the people that saved me. This book means so much to me that I wanted to share it. So it's been a perfect gift to thank the nurses who have such a You've done such a special job every day. The gift of life is very precious. That's it. <laughs>